welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I've got a huge homeware haul for you guys. I'm filming this intro before I go out shopping, but I'm basically going to be going shopping today. I've already bought some bits yesterday, but I'm going to be going shopping today and getting loads of bits for the house because the house just needs more life like it needs pictures and decor and things like that so yeah i'm gonna go off shopping today and when i get back i'm gonna come and film a homeware haul for you guys thought i'd just film the intro now so i can just come straight back later and film the rest of the video but yeah i really hope you guys enjoy this video if you do please be sure to smash a big thumbs up for me subscribe if you're new don't forget to turn my post notification bell on so you don't miss any of the videos follow me on instagram and without further ado let's get into the video so really quickly before i play the homeware haul clips i just wanted to talk to you guys about wild deodorant i'm sure you guys have heard about these because they are literally amazing i'll do a little close-up on the screen they are the cutest deodorants ever it's actually personalized with my name on so i have been using wild for a while now i've got a couple of other ones with their deodorants but this one in particular is their charcoal one for the new year i'm trying to look at things that are more sustainable and i'm going to start off with my wild deodorant i've switched over to the um wild limited edition charcoal one it's just such an easy sustainable swap to make so they have so many other types of deodorants but this one is the charcoal one so for this limited edition version they've added a detoxifying ingredient which is obviously activated charcoal this draws out over a hundred times more bacteria which is gonna get rid of and eliminate any of them bad odors they are so easy to use they're so easy to refill you literally just squeeze the sides pop the bottom off and you can literally just take your refills off and then pop a new one on it's literally as easy as that i absolutely love the wild deodorants they are so good for sensitive skin and they literally keep you dry all day without blocking your pores they've got so many other smells that you can choose from as well another one of my favorites is coconut and vanilla they also do a rhubarb one i think and they also do a pink grapefruit one and i can confirm that they all smell insane i think holly has a couple as well and she absolutely swears by this deodorant as well and the perfect little size as well to take away with you anywhere you want to go it also contains shea butter so it makes your skin feel so smooth and non-drying which i absolutely love in a deodorant overall i'm literally obsessed honestly you just twist it up and roll on and you're literally good to go you can just wind it back down and obviously pop the lid on and as i said at the beginning of the video you can personalize it as well which is such a nice little extra touch so yeah overall i'm a huge fan of wild deodorant if you guys want to shop from wild i will leave the link down below in the description you can also use my code erin b which i'll pop on the screen and that's going to get you 20 percent off of wild products which is unreal so make sure you shop below um in the description go and grab your deodorants and make sure to let me know down below or in my dms on instagram what scent you go for you can also head over to their trust pilot page they've got like over eight thousand reviews or something and they're pretty much all excellent so if you want to head over there and have a look at some of their reviews they are literally all amazing you can see like um some other people's opinions and things like that yeah i'll leave everything all the information down below in the description for you guys and yeah i hope you guys enjoy and let's get into the video so guys I am back from my shopping trip. I'm not gonna lie, it didn't go as well as I thought it would. I feel like shops are still recovering from like Christmas period and stuff, and they haven't got a huge amount of stock. In the end, I went to Asda, Home Sense, and the range. Asda, I got the most bits in, and Home Sense, she had zero. So yeah, I'll show you everything I got. I also went to Zara yesterday. So I'm gonna start off with Asda. So I got about three big bags from Asda. The first thing I picked up was a fitted sheet in king size. I just got a dark grey one because obviously I tan quite a lot and they get ruined quite easily. Um, so I just like to throw them away every now and then because they just get so dirty with fake tan. Um, I did actually see online, um, I think it was on TikTok actually, that you can buy these things from Next and you can like sleep in them and they're like sleeping bags for tanning. Um, so I think I'm gonna get one of them, but yeah, we needed a new one anyway. Um, it's really nice material and I don't even know how much this is, but I think they're like a fiver or something like that, but I really like the Asda ones. So I picked up one of those. Then Brandon actually picked up a candle. This is the Yankee Candle Unicorn Dreams. It was actually only £9 in Asda. It literally smells insane. Do you know what? It smells a bit like the Pink Sands one. But it's really, really nice. I literally love that. And we have a massive candle stash now. We have a little cupboard now underneath the stairs that we had built. And we've filled it with candles now. So another one to add to the collection because we just go through them like crazy. I then picked up some Command Picture Hanging Hooks because we've been putting a few bits up in the house. We put Brandon's Yuji plaque up the other day and there's a frame 
in his room that he needs putting up. We found these ones really good. They're almost like, like Velcro sort of. So yeah, and we removed some the other day and they didn't take the paint off the wall at all. So I really recommend these. So yeah, I picked up some of those, mainly for Brandon, but I thought he'd appreciate that. Then in Asda as well, I needed some dishmatic heads because I can't find any. I'm sure I've got loads of these somewhere, um, but they're not under my sink, so I have no idea where else they'd be. So yeah, I picked up some of them. Um, and then Brandon picked up actually some, oh, I've got a packet of chewing gum, I needed some of that. I always like chewing gum, I never had any. Um, these trays, so he actually ordered some like this on Amazon. Don't know if they were more expensive or not. Uh, they literally have the exact same in Asda. So they're just these little plastic trays. I think they were like one pound fifty or something like that which is quite good um, but he's organizing all his drawers in his office um so i said for him to get a few of these he can put like his cables batteries i don't know all the techie stuff that he likes to do so he picked up two of those then in asda as well i picked up this little stand-up mirror when we moved house i had one of these but it smashed so i got a new one quite handy to just like either have in the bathroom kind of like look at something up close or like tweeze my eyebrows or something like i need a close-up mirror because i've only got my big light up mirror nice to have a close-up mirror but like even to do my makeup in because that mirror like when you sit at it it's like quite far away and i like to do my makeup like quite close up so yeah i bought one of these i'm not really sure how much it was but it's a really nice one actually like it's got a nice like marble bottom um these are nicer bathrooms as well they had like a lot of the matching stuff in there as well they had like the soap dispensers and the little trays and things like that Pick one of those up this is actually really random not really homeware but we got i, I said we brian and got a nintendo switch for christmas and i've been using it a little bit as well so we picked up the big brain academy nintendo switch game let me know if any of you have played this before this was like my childhood i played it on the wii the best game ever i don't think brandon's ever played it but it's such a good game so yeah i picked that up i then picked up some new glasses because a couple of ours have smashed so i just got these long tall ones i think i got one or two of those and i picked up these ones which i thought were really nice i like the shorter one and they're only like cheap as that but i think they're like they just look so nice and like so effective and um, so yeah we picked up a couple of long ones and a couple of short ones because yeah as i said we've um smashed quite a few of our glasses so yeah i thought these would be good i like these as well these smaller ones for when you just want a little glass you know yeah pick those up then i think these are the last two things i've got in asda i find that we always lose towels and towels are like we don't have a tumble dryer so towels in our house are a nightmare to dry so i picked up another two because when like they're in the wash like we don't have towels and stuff so these are 100 cotton super soft bath towel i find with asda they don't have their prices on anything it's really annoying but yeah they're just bath towels dark gray because i tan and they just go with the house yeah i just picked up i just picked up one for me one for brandon and they're really really soft and really really nice quality so i also have a couple of these like sort of bath towels from tesco which are really good as well and a lot of ours are ikea as well i swear we have literally got probably about 30 towels and they just go missing i don't know about anyone else but towels always go missing in my house but yeah picked up a, another two towels so that is everything i picked up in as, as you know it's not i've got one more thing from asda brandon has been complaining about the bin because we have those ones where like the foot pedal ones where the lid opens and shuts and he says oh you can't fit a lot in it so i was like okay get one for the ensuite so he picked up this white marble bin again i don't know how much it was i think it was like 12 pounds or something like that it's really really good quality it's a white marble bin and it's just like an open one so you can just put all our rubbish in it in the ensuite i was gonna get these for every single bathroom but we don't use the middle one as often and we don't use the bottom one at all really so yeah i thought it'd just be good to get an open one so we can fit more things in it and i really like the design on it so yeah pick this up yeah i think it was like 12 or 15 pounds roughly but the quality is really good like they're not like really cheap plasticky ones i don't know what material it is but it's really really nice quality so yeah we picked up that now moving on to the range i really didn't get too much in the range um but i actually picked up this really nice lantern it's actually a black chrome um it's got a couple of scratches on but it's chrome so i guess it sort of easily happens and um, but i thought i would get this for the lounge we actually have a new coffee table now i'll see if i can insert a picture of it on screen for you guys to see but it's actually white marble with black um like legs so i thought i'd pick up this black lantern and it can go in the corner of our living room and um, with a candle on it i don't know if it's safe guys but in these lanterns if i put like a pillar candle in it like can that then rest on the carpet I don't know if that's safe or not. Please let me know down below. But yeah, I thought it was really, really nice. I couldn't work out if it was silver or not at first, but it's definitely black chrome. I've already got another two lanterns in the lounge, which are silver from next. I thought this one would just like fill that little gap in the corner of our sofa really nicely. So yeah, I picked that up. I'm not sure how much that was. I think it was like £15, which I didn't actually think was too bad. Also from the range, I picked up some cleaning products. I picked up 
the flash spray wipe frosted berries spray because at the minute i've only got a method one on the go uh, literally guys i am not a hoarder of cleaning products anymore i used to be um but they just go out of date and they go off and go funny so yeah i picked this up because we just needed a antibacterial spray heard this one's really good i think i saw this in anastasia's vlog actually um but you can use it on pretty much everything and it's the frosted berries one limited edition so yeah i picked that up to go underneath the sink um and then i picked this up which was really exciting i saw this a while ago but i just haven't had the chance to try it yet it's limited edition so i'm not sure how much longer it's gonna be around for but it's the lenore ocean breeze summer vibes fabric softener i've actually nearly run out of fabric softener so i needed to get a top up so i thought i'd try this one let me give it a smell test mm. to be fair it just smells quite similar to spring awakening but yeah i like that it's a nice fresh scent so yeah i picked up a big bottle of that for my washing that i never do i need to get on top of my washing because it gets very out of hand yeah i picked that up i couldn't find the pods i'm not sure if they do the pods but i tried to find them but they didn't have them i then picked up two packs of white as well i say i did brandon did and they are the smallest wipes going i thought he would have picked up a big pack but he picked up the tiniest pack in there um, but these are just the flash these are the flash extra large wipes and um, i don't like buying wipes too often because they're not the best for the environment but it's really handy to have just a small pack every now and then if i quickly just need to wipe something down um they're just quite handy to have yeah they're just a lemon scent and i picked up two packs of them because they're just good to have around the house so yeah pick them up then the last um cleaning product i picked up was a zaflora i've actually stopped buying zaflora for a while now because it's not amazing for dogs like it, obviously it's not overly safe for dogs like it can be like as it dries but i've been trying not to use it as much but i haven't had this scent in the longest time it's one of my favorites it's um rose noir it's definitely one of my favorites like i literally love it oh that looks a bit of a funny color yeah i remember now it smells so good i think it smells a bit like cherries yeah i literally love it you can literally use a flora for everything mm. i use it in my bathrooms um the worktops the sink toilets literally everything it's such a good product you guys know i rave about the floor i actually got some for christmas from random from my dad which was handy so yeah i got that the last thing i've got to show you is from zara um so i picked up these cushions actually picked up three of these i wanted some cushions to break up our sofa because it's all great and the cushions are great um because basically the sofa we have the cushions are the back of the sofa so i wanted some white ones to break it up but these just don't look quite right um so so i've got my day bed coming as you guys know so i think i'm just gonna keep them for um my day bed um so just these really nice white linen cushions with the fluff around the sides which i thought was really nice these guys were um so yeah i picked up three of these for the sofa but they just didn't look quite right i don't know if it was because they weren't big enough or they were more for like a bed but i just thought i'd keep them anyway um 7.99 for the cover and i'm pretty sure the filling was like six pounds or something so overall i didn't think these cushions were that expensive and they're really good quality for zara i thought they was gonna be quite pricey but they're actually really, really good. So, yeah, I really love these. And um, once I've got my bed in and stuff, my day bed, I think I'm going to pop these on there for my room. So, yeah, I picked up um, three of those. So, I think they'll go really nicely on that bed. And then I might get, like, a um, smaller ones, just, like, break them up a little bit. So, yeah, that is everything I picked up. Guys, enjoyed this video. If you want to see another video, because I'm always buying things for the house, um, then let me know down below and I'm sure to do that for you. Um, don't forget you guys can shop wild for 20% off with my link in the description. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to smash a big thumbs up for me. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to turn post notification bell on so you don't miss any of the videos. Follow me on Instagram and I'll see you guys with a brand new video on Wednesday at 6pm. Bye!